Peace and Pan-Africanism, peace and Pan-Africanism. Peace and Pan-Africanism, peace and Pan-Africanism. This is your big brother, Dr. Umar Ifatunde, and I am live and direct in Druryville, Virginia, Southampton County, Jerusalem, now called Cortland, where the great prophet Nat Turner was executed. I am standing in the general area where Nat Turner is thought to have been hanged on November the 11th of 1831. Brothers and sisters, I'm standing on sacred ground. I'm standing on sacred ground. I'm standing on sacred ground. There's three historical plaques that have been installed. These were not here when I was here last time. These are new. The county just added these three historical plaques that talk about Nat Turner's execution, brothers and sisters. I am here today because Nat Turner was born today. I am here today because Nat Turner was born today. His war began on my Earth Day, August the 21st, 1831. And the war ended when Nat Turner was executed near this site. This is where Nat Turner was hanged. Near this site. That's why they have these new historical markers here. He was hanged here on November the 11th, 1831. Nat Turner was hanged here November the 11th, 1831. I will be back here. God willing, on November the 11th, 1831. Place of execution where Nat Turner died. How you doing, good sister? I got a question for you. I got a question for you. The tree that Nat Turner was hanged on, that was cut down. But do you know where it stood? Um, no, because I'm from Norfolk. I'm not from here. Okay, you're not from, I got you. Uh -uh. Okay, because I always get different stories. Some people say the tree was right here. Some say it was in front of one of these homes. Mm -hmm. And the owner of the home had it cut down. That's what some people, well, they definitely had it cut down. So I'm thinking it must have been closer to one of the homes mm -hmm. if the owner was able to get it cut down. You know what I mean? Because if it was here, they probably would have left it because there's nothing else here. Yeah, but they got a lot of stuff. Uh, what is it, the hanging tree? That, well, that's the tree I'm talking about. But they got sign, street sign in Franklin that says that. Okay, but okay. John told me about that one. Okay. Safe travels, Queen. Yeah. All right, now. Yes, ma I was born on August the 21st, which is the day the Nat Turner War started. So I come, I've been coming down here for 13 years on August 21st and on November the 11th where he was hanged here. And so this is the first time in 13 years I came on his birthday, which is today, October 2nd. So it's a, it's a, it's a journey we do. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> yes, ma'am. Travel safe, queen. All right. I'm trying to find out where the tree that hanged Nat Turner actually stood. I'm trying to find out where the tree where Nat Turner was hanged actually stood, brothers and sisters. They say he was hanged closer to down here, y'all. They say he was hanged closer to down here. I wish someone who lived in one of these homes would come outside because I would ask them. That lady cutting the grass, I wonder if she knows. The tree was somewhere around here.
one day I'm going to find out exactly where. Now, there go a big tree that was cut down. Peace and Pan-Africanism, Peace and Pan-Africanism. Some more historical markers on the life of Nat Turner. Some more historical markers that have been implemented on the life of Nat Turner. I was here November of 2022. These were not here November of 2022. So all of these are new brothers and sisters. This talks about John Brown. Not the white man who led the insurrection on Harpers Ferry, but this black man right here, his name was John Brown. He was born right here in Southampton County, Virginia. He was sold to Georgia. He wrote a famous slave narrative, which helped bring awareness to the plight of enslaved Africans in America. This shows you how they used to punish us with bells and horns around the neck and around the skull if you tried to run away. This right here talks about where Nat Turner tried to cross the Nottaway Bridge, but he couldn't because it was too well guarded. This shows one of the places where some of Nat Turner's army were imprisoned after they were captured. All of this is new. So they are clearly bringing attention to the Nat Turner war now, probably because of us constantly coming down here and to take, you know, attention away from Baba Khalifa and others who have been educating on Nat Turner. This is not being done because they care about Nat Turner. This is being done for tourism and money. Tourism, money, and publicity, brothers and sisters. So I just want to show you that. So y'all can see. Make sure y'all bring a trip down here as well. Over here is the courthouse. That's where Nat Turner was tried. This is not the original courthouse. This is a new one, but that's where Nat Turner was tried. That's where he gave his famous interview to Thomas Gray on November the 1st. And then he was marched to the location that was on my previous live where Nat Turner was executed. They're redoing the courthouse now. I just wanted to show y'all King Kong consciousness live and direct from Nat Turner land where Nat Turner was executed, brothers and sisters. They now have historical markers here. And I'm trying to find out where the tree stood. I'm going to find out one day where the tree stood, brothers and sisters. I'm now on my way to the Nat Turner Library with Elder H. Khalif Khalifa. And we're going to celebrate Nat Turner today. Virginia, pull up 26070 Barham's Hill Road. 26070 Barham's Hill Road today. We'll be hanging out till about seven o'clock. Hit the cash app. I'm on the land where Nat Turner was executed. This is your brother King Kong Consciousness.